Rape, drunk driving, suicidal thoughts. They're all heavy topics, very heavy, but reality for a lot of Arkansas high schoolers. Thank you for joining us at 10. I'm Bob Clausen. And I'm Ashley Ketz. A new CDC study found the state ranks number one in these and other troubling topics among teens. KRK 4s Jesse Tenor joins us in studio to break down the findings. Jesse? Yeah, Ashley and Bob, doctors I spoke with point out these are all self-reported behaviors from teens who responded confidentially, so some of these numbers here may be a little inflated. But together they call the results overwhelming, showing the state has a lot of work to do. Before graduation caps fly in the air, a lot of high schoolers lived the previous four years by a checklist. Get good grades, make friends, participate in extracurriculars. But another list shows how troubled Arkansas students are before they even finish their senior year. This, this should be a wake-up call for parents. A CDC study released earlier this month found Arkansas ranked first in the country for teenagers who were bullied on school property, seriously considered suicide, forced to have sex, and drove drunk. And all of these behaviors that we see in this report our pay, uh, behaviors that kids are modeling on their parents. The father of two girls, Dr. Gary Wheeler, found the rape statistic to be the most troubling. The real issue is not sex education, but the way that women are treated uh, or the way that young men learn to treat women. A second doctor says coupling the suicide findings with two other results, Arkansas students are more likely to have carried weapons on school property and to have been threatened or injured with weapons at school should sound more alarms. This looks to me like we could be sitting on another explosive school situation. The question remains what to do next. Something these doctors can't find a single cure for. We know what the big challenges are, uh, but we're still struggling, I think, to find the solutions to move Arkansas forward. Arkansas students also rank first in obesity, asthma, and sports-related concussions. One positive note here, the number of high schoolers who say they smoke cigarettes daily has decreased from 37% 10 years ago to now 14%. Back to you.